Hello friends. Stepper Motors. Today we are going to learn how to check stepper motors and build Arduino and L298 and driver project. I've got about 14 different kind of salvaged stepper motors for a few bucks and now I'm going to show you them. Mitsumi Motor It's from Thailand. It's from China. Japan Servo. Japan Servo. These are with the mounting brackets. Most of motors are looks in working condition. but few of them look stuck their rotor. Let's learn how to check a stepper motor without any special circuitry. All you need is, some tool or wire to short circuit motor pins. Connect pins and rotate the motor, then release the connection while still turning the motor. You will feel it's hard to turn the motor, when pins are connected. This way you can identify whether each terminal is in working condition. Let's check another motor. Hard to rotate when pins are connected. And easy to rotate when released. Let's make our project with Arduino and L298 and driver. I connect the motor wire and attach it to the L298 NH bridge motor driver terminals.
I connect these two pins together. Then connect L298 and signal input pins to Arduino's 8, 9, 10, and 11 pins. Connect the power and common ground pins. I use AC to DC 9 volts power adapter to power the L298 and driver. Let's code our Arduino program. steps per revolution, this may depend on the motor. Define the stepper. Set speed. I add serial monitor to view the status. Clockwise. Step the motor clockwise. I add a few of them. Then, the reverse order. I use the minus value of steps per revolution. We need to add some delay between them. That's it. Now select the Arduino Uno board and the port. Save the Arduino sketch. Upload. Open the serial monitor to view the status. Everything looks good and working. Yes, the motor is spinning. If you 
you get any vibration or undesired behavior of the motor, just change the followings. Try exchanging four terminals of the motor. Change the MISTA per speed using set speed. Change the step per revolution value, depending on your stepper motor specifications. I got a few motors stuck on their rotors, and I hope to disassemble them for some repair. I will bring you that video soon, and many more stepper motor projects with these handy set of motors. Subscribe Project Weekend channel, by clicking the red subscribe button below, and enable the notification icon below to get notified when I release a new video. Please like and share the video if you like it, and have fun with stepper motors. See you soon in next video with a new project, using these handy stepper motors.